I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome back to Be Glitched. Took a bit longer to get back to this than I thought it would, but uh, hey, better late than never, I guess. Hello, stranger. This is a pretty quiet forum, actually. It's pretty loud. That's better. It shouldn't be particularly dangerous. If you want to talk to the denizens here, use the talk button located in the same place as the login button when you're occupying the same computer node. You might just learn a few things. Have fun, glitch witch. I gotta talk to the mushroom men. They look like good friends. Dang, Glitch Witch! I didn't know how you keep track of all the sectors your battle grid do. I think in your shoes, I would constantly have to click and hold sectors to see the descriptions. Oh, giving me tutorials, huh? Wait. Does that not work here? Oh, it's been so long that I've forgotten my terminology. I'll, I'll just keep that in mind. Hey, buddy. Hey, Glitch Witch, isn't it weird how moving hackers will never move on top of the activated compass or computer sectors? I think it must be something primal. Something how nobody actually wants to be seen, to be exposed, even here. Isn't it because they don't want to be found so you can't blow them up? I mean, sure, that's basically what I said. Sort of. Alright. Wait, let me read that again. Moving hackers will never appear on top of activated compass. Okay, so okay, so they never deliberately expose themselves, so you can use that to sort of figure things out a bit. Glitch Witch, good to see you. Keeping your serial ports nice and clean, I hope. Look at his mustache. Look at that. Listen, the modern air. I, I guess that's the moderator and a mayor. Ask you to come around next time you're around. The modern air, exactly. That's moderator and mayor put together. An old joke of his. He should be around here somewhere. That was really not a appropriately dapper voice, but whatever. I'm not feeling very dapper today. I I'm getting back into the recording. It's like my throat is already ruined. Hey, Glitch Witch. Bet you already knew this. But I just learned that your battle grid stays the same in between battles. That means you can use an easy battle to prepare your grid for a difficult battle. That's so cool! That is so cool. I I doubt I'll bother. Yes, I definitely do that. I doubt I'll bother to take advantage of that. What is this E? Zone transfer. Oh, Mr. Mushroom Man! Word of warning, my friend. You don't want to go over to that side of the network. It's not pretty. Oh, hell yeah, I do! Oh! I'm serious, friend. You really don't want to go over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, you do! Oh! Whatevs. Nada. Ah. Oh. Whatevs. Whatevs. Scan. Twenty bucks. No, no, no scan. Ah, uh, what's in here? It's dangerous over there. I've been giving instructions to stand and not let anyone through this node. Sorry. Up. Oh, script. Oh. Uh, that's that's all his dialogue. Okay. Well. Let's go to the only place we can actually go. Oh, Mr. Raccoon Man. Hey, Glitch Witch. We've never met, but I heard you were uh, pretty good at computers. Why don't you give me a demonstration? I'll bury eggs and treasure in the nodes surrounding us. You just move to the node you think has the treasure. I mean, I don't know how to solve this. It seems like you need to be able to reveal multiple screens at once. Powerful techniques, you know. But it seems kind of things would be some as premium as alleged, you're alleged to be. It was a hint that we're... What? Egg. I don't know. There's... I forget which one is which. Uh, um... What was I doing again? Just move to the node you think has the treasure. Alright, so this is next to an egg. This is next to two eggs. Okay, so the dot is the treasure. Okay. Okay, I remember it. Okay. I wasted 20 bucks, but whatever. Cool, but uh, you know, it could have been an 
accident. Sorry. Things cheeky. Could you do that one more time? Okay, so that's connected to a, an egg. That's connected to treasure. That's connected to treasure. To this one. Well, you got it right. Come back here. So yeah, this is just testing my scan ability. Uh, one more time. What do you mean? They're all connected to eggs. What do you mean? There you go. I, f I figured it must be a trick. I just didn't want to say my secrets to you until I exactly knew how premium you were, Glitch Witch. Follow me. I'll show you something cool. This exit to the left made a special program I made. It will warp you somewhere randomly inside your own computer. That sounds safe. Why would you want to do that? Well, when you're as premium as we are, you end up with all sorts of cool stuff lying around. It becomes easy to forget where some of your older work locked away in some strange places in your hard drive. I definitely recommend giving it a try. Hee <laughs> hee. Seems safe. Hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, we just got screwed over, didn't we? Ooh, secrets.txt. That's where I keep all of my secrets. Why would you keep them anywhere other than secrets.txt? That way you can just type in secrets.txt into, you know, the Windows command bar, and there you go, your secrets. Top-notch security, my friends. It's so obvious that no one would think to try it. It's a perfect crime. Rhythm of good typing can soothe an aching back, they say. Me, I want a t t keyboard that is also a tap dancer. These are some high-quality secrets. Clacks should sorely exceed clicks. I'm a bit like a clack, but I'm garish when I heard alone. But maybe you should listen for a few seconds so you can find a pattern of my steps. Personally, I'm all about the clacks. Let me listen to these clacks. I, I don't like the clicks. I don't like the cherry blue switches. They're too clicky. The, the clacky switches. I got the cherry MX browns. Uh, very good, good feel. Uh, not too loud. And most importantly, they're, they're lower pitch. I don't like the high pitch of the, uh, of the Cherry MX, uh, blues. And the IBM model, what is it, 100? That's a bit, that's a bit loud. That was, a, that's a buckling spring one. Those are real loud. They're, does anyone make new buckling springs? I'm pretty fine with my keyboard, really, but, uh, it's getting up there. I guess I got it. I guess it's about four or five years old, but it's a DOS keyboard. It's, uh, like I said, Cherry MX Brown. I, I didn't get the uh, the one with no <laughs> buttons. I was kind of tempted, the one with no labels. Anyway, my mouse battery will only expire when it rains. It was a curse the witch put on me when I was little. Curse or not, she was cool. I'm losing some respect for you upon hearing that your, you ha your mouse has a battery. I mean... Maybe it's for her laptop. Maybe it's for her. Yeah, I mean, mm. she taught she taught me how to smoke when I was eighteen, and I vomited on her roof. Those those are the bonding moments you remember forever. You you will never forget vomiting on someone's roof. Let me let me tell you that much. I kind of wish you could access my roof, not for vomiting purposes, but though you can't stand over. The, the porch way. I'm not sure if that s sustains human weight, and I'm not sure I want to find out without, you know, asking someone a bit more building savvy than myself. Anyway. So you're to a lot of things to just pretend they're other things. Exactly. Sage. Sage. When it's hot, and it's always hot around here, just imagine there's a simple breeze on your skin. When it's boring, just imagine a skateboarder doing cool tricks on the roadside as your car moves by. Then you accidentally hit the skateboarder. Isn't that fun? Our sensations aren't set in stone, and if they are, I bet someone has an uncle who can lend us a chisel. Ah oh, yes, chisel my senses. That's I'm all about chiseling those senses. The shoutouts to this scrolling text ruining my bitrate. Um, rules of baseball, as I understand them. <laughs> oh, that's, this is going to be good. Rule number six. There's a lot of crying in baseball. <laughs> Accurate. Very accurate. The tears of the greatest baseball players will fill stadiums. <laughs> Very accurate description of sports. Rule number eight, you cannot become better at baseball. The limited talent are marked at birth with a permanent marker and salt. 
If this idea repulses you, if you wake up sweating at the merest hint that it might be true, congratulations. You just might make the starting lineup. Wait, was that number... No, that was number four. I always wanted to cat. These are very good secrets, by the way. These are... Just a little kiss of the hand there. Beautiful. I always wanted a cat, but my apartment only allows dogs. What? What kind of crappy apartment is that? Have you seen a dog and a cat? Dogs do ten times the damage of frickin' any cat. We, we actually allow dog or cats. Well, it depends on the place, but usually, you know, we charge more for dogs. Dogs destroy more things. I mean, it's largely a size issue. I mean, you know, a hundred pound dog versus ten pound cat, you know, more damage. That, that's why we don't have a hundred pound cats. A hundred pound cats would, they would just kill you. Anyway, who signs a piece of paper without spitting on it first? I know I don't. Mostly because the sorcerer stole my signature. Oop. Oh, hold up. Oh, nope. Nope. I tried to meditate with my eyes open, but I could only see my but I could only see my own reflection in my monitors. I turned the chair around and I saw my reflection in the refrigerator. Why do you have a glossy refrigerator? Well, I guess they do have those. No, the like the silver ones are usually like brushed steel so you can't see your oh, whatever. Now I meditate on my broken toilet that won't stop flushing. <laughs> Good. I hear the chakras are particularly powerful on the toilets that won't stop flushing. Is a good replacement for a waterfall. I will follow the path of the flushing toilet. That sounds like that sounds like the path to extremely high water bills. Here's a good secret. For when you think you have no idea what you're doing, you stand paralyzed by your own perceived incompetence. Oh, this is gonna be very useful for me. This is important. Listen, this is it. Nobody knows what they're doing. Yeah, that's right. Even Santa Claus. Exactly. It, it, Santa is that like Santa Claus. Is that like lawyer Santa? He delivers subpoenas to all the bad girls and boys. Ooh, the woods! I like that folder. That is a good... Oh, it's like a text adventure. Uh, find.txt. I always knew which operating system was because of what games came already installed. That is a pretty valid way to check things. I also always knew, I mean, the user interface is usually a bit of a giveaway, but I also knew how hard it was to uninstall those games and all the places that teachers would try to hide them. North. Oh. <laughs> There's special music for the woods. Credit. Credit is a strange object. Credit is cash to give. Credit is a recognition to receive. Credit is a gateway to play. Here's some credits I found. Insert them where you will. <laughs> and it's just, it's the actual credits. Uh, Jenny Zhao Hisa, uh, design visuals, AP Thompson, design audio writing programming. There you go. Credits. Oh! East, north. Wait. Oh, 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 I thought it was looping. Swamp. Oh, yes! Two beings cannot just swap. Oh, I thought it said swamp. A third being needs to exist. Being bridge, bridge, bees. <laughs> True. I, I get this little programmer joke, I guess. I'd like to swap with you, but where is our bridge? Are you are you asking for a threesome? Because I'm very interested. Oh, frick. I think I just got rejected for the, that threesome. Lie.txt. That's a good, that's a good, t that's another good file. These are some very good files. I was told long ago this statement isn't a lie unless you know that it's false. I know a lot of people to believe that. Rather than improving the complexity of my morals, the lesson to force may always consider what is real. Africa. North. Stone. How long has it been since you pushed into a butt? Since being pushed into a body of water. Pool, a creek, the ocean. I don't really like being pushed into bodies of water. I don't float. Like, I, I know how to swim. I took swimming lessons. I can swim. I know how to do the strokes. Um, at least since around high school, I haven't attempted it since, I, I don't float, I just go down. You put me in the deep end and somebody's got to drag me out. It's unpleasant. Um, evolved from being a standard prank into an all-out betrayal? 
That's what I don't. Ooh! Oh, I thought that said positions.txt. I thought we were getting a little raunchy. Potions.txt is good too. Maybe they're raunchy potions. You, you, you don't know. You don't know things, viewer. Do not presume. Ahem. <laughs> How an actual. If I were an actual witch, I would fail potions class. Not because of a lack of ability, but because I keep sampling the assignments. Mmm, tasty. This one makes you big. This one makes you small. This one makes you someone else. This one makes you who you truly are. Those are some good potions. Invading network. Oh! Huh? Hey, what? I don't know what these are. Oh, it's an item bank. What's this? Zip file! Use an unzipper here to zip this file. I don't have unzippers. This is a zip file. I do it do it buy? Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Frick. I don't have an unzipper. I guess I'll have to remember to come back. Does that put me back into the forest? Aw oh, crap, where's the secrets that TXC? Okay. Okay, good. Okay, same situation. Okay, I, I honestly think, I guess we didn't, you know, it was all exploration today, but, ah, frick, no, 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 no. Um, I think I'm gonna try to keep things more towards like 15 minutes instead of the longer videos, so I'm just gonna see if this, did, uh, did I read the stone one? Potions. Woods 5. North. Ooh. Okay. Ah. Okay. No. Just want to verify. Gift.txt. Sometimes you get an incredible thing you want to try it out right away, but you can't. Like getting a remote control plane for your birthday when you live deep in the city. Maybe looking at the box will be more fun anyway. Uh-oh. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in these woods. Alright, I think... Okay, I think we have explored all of the woods now. Alright. I guess that's it for this, um, and we'll come, go back in and try to get into some more beglitched battles next time. Uh, as always, thanks for watching.